Hello everyone, welcome to another exciting Minecraft Let's Play episode. I am Tyken, and today we're going to be digging out the inside of our home, as well as maybe trying to fix that to make it look nice. Not sure if I want it all flat, or... I don't know. Well, we'll get to it when I get to it. Uh, I'm going to be digging some stuff out. Uh, I'm going to most likely fast-forward through all this, but I did want to uh, talk about a few things before, you know, I forget. Uh, first of all, one of the things I wanted to mention is... Uh, let's see. Oh, yes. I wanted to kind of give a shout-out to uh, one of my fans. Uh, a while ago, back when I made my uh, Death Star video, where I built the Death Star and showed it off, and how it works and everything, uh, someone, uh, I, f I forget their name, but I'll, b I'll be linking their channel and everything in the description below, uh, has did a video essentially remixing my voice and putting it to music, um, kind of like a soundboard type of thing, uh, basically using all the all the words and phrases I said during that video to make a Death Star, and I think it was kick-ass at the time, and I told him a while ago that I would give him a shout-out, you know, direct people to his channel because I liked it that much, but uh, to be honest, I have a terrible memory, and uh, thanks to one of my other friends for reminding me, uh, I finally decided to write it down so I didn't forget anything this time. Looks like it's already starting to get night. Actually, wait a second. Aha! I knew it. Good thing. Uh, anyway, back to on topic. Uh, it's really awesome video. I'll be linking his channel and everything in the description below. Please check it out. Guy has awesome skills. Uh, he's been doing videos like this for my other friend who also does uh, Minecraft videos. Uh, the Brothers Grimm or something like that. Uh, Dark Grimm Productions, I think, is the channel. But anyway, um, I really like the guy's video. I think uh, I think it'd be really cool uh, if people started doing more videos like that. Like um, someone even made a comment about making a soundboard for Tyken, which I think would just be awesome and hilarious at the same time. And if anyone does that, like uh, makes a video for me that isn't just like a, a, a let's play video or anything like that. Um, you know, just something neat. I would be willing to uh, either post it on my channel and, you know, link it to yours, or uh, just accept it as a video response to whichever video. And I think that would be both fun and interesting, uh, just to see what, what you guys can produce video-wise, and, I don't know, see where it goes from there. Hmm, I think I'm going to go ahead and skip... Actually... Haha, better idea. Instead of going all the way back, I brought a bed, and I have enough wood. It's kind of scary that nothing's spawned around me yet. Uh, I'm just waiting to hear a hiss noise come right up behind me. Because that's generally how it works. You have your back turned, everything's going fine. Uh, also, I decided to start using lava because I, f I, I remember someone told me a while ago that they fixed it where lava doesn't use your lava bucket, like it, it uses just the lava and gives you your bucket back. And I tested it, and it works, which is just damn awesome. Okay, let's go in here before anything uh, decides to creep up behind me. Okay, let's go ahead and go to bed, and we'll skip to the next day. Okay, we're back awake now. Uh, also, another thing I really wanted to mention, uh, mostly just kind of idly mention, um, before I start fast-forwarding through all this, because... You know, might as well have something interesting to say. Uh, one of the things uh, I noticed is that a while ago, someone said when I mentioned something about Minecraft, like the next patch it was implemented, which means someone at Mojang may be watching my videos and likes my ideas. Of course, I'm not the I'm probably not the first person to ever think of these things, and again, I'm probably not the first to ever suggest them. But maybe, um, I don't know, they just like hearing me say it, <laughs> I don't know. But I, I kind of wanted to test this theory because it, it seemed to happen again considering um, the first time it happened, I was like, well, let's go ahead and give this a real test. Um, I would like to have trapdoors implemented in the next, well not the next patch, just in the game sometime soon. Um, and the next patch, oddly enough, 1.6, yeah, because it was 1.5 at the time, because um, I remember talking about, I'm not sure if it was during 1.5 or 1.6, but regardless, it happened in 1.6, which was kind of...
kind of soon. But anyway, um, trapdoors were implemented, which leads me to believe that the person that mentioned someone at Mojang may be watching my videos may not be too far off, and if so, that's just damn awesome. And I would love to know if this is true or not. But again, we kind of run into the thing where I can't actually prove it unless someone from Mojang specifically sends me a message, which I doubt would ever happen. Uh, so I kind of wanted to have one more test, which I really doubt this is going to be implemented in the next patch or even the one after that. Um, I actually have a couple of ideas, but the main one I want to list is I would really, really like to have uh, the ability to farm uh, all the different types of plants and materials in Minecraft. Like, uh, I know they're working on flower spread. I think that might have actually been implemented. I'm not sure yet. Uh, and I know they worked on mushroom spread, but I think it would be really cool to actually have a farm out of it where you can plant, like, uh, seeds. Because they have this uh, one mod. I'm not sure if... I think it's Expanded Farming. Yeah, by the same guy that does Fancy Pack. And it's really cool because you can right-click with a hoe on essentially any uh, plant and you get uh, a seed from it, or a clipping, rather, that you can plant, depending on the type of plant. Um, so essentially, it allows you to farm pretty much the same way as wheat, any plant. Uh, same as, like, you can use the mod to farm mushrooms. Um, I know you can do that now, but uh, that's slightly different. Um, although, I guess it doesn't really matter, as long as it works. Uh, you can use it to... Uh, farm pumpkins, which are always a resource people are always wanting, but are very limited and rare. Uh, you can use it to farm flowers. You just get a flower seed, and, you know, it's random what kind of flower you get. And I think that's all. All the plants, anyway, because you can already uh, farm cactus and reed, and trees, of course. But I think that would be really cool to uh, uh, implement, or perhaps even more types of plants that we can harvest, such as, uh, you know, different types of foods, different types of just materials that we can uh, farm, because that's, that's always really fun to do. People love making automated farms, even if it's kind of useless. Um, I don't know. I just think it's, it would be a really cool thing to do and add more plants and farmability to the game. Wow, this is a lot of room so far. Um, but uh, I did have a couple of other ideas that I did want to mention to add to the game. Of course, that plant thing would be, if it is added, like any new plants or anything, I would be pretty much, sur uh, pretty much, uh, I guess sure, or uh, confirmed that someone over there is listening, which would be just damn awesome. But again, I really doubt it, so I'm kind of giving a... a a test that I really doubt would happen, considering Notch specifically said uh, 1.7 is going to be a long ways away, and it's going to be an adventure-style uh, upgrade to Minecraft. So I doubt it's going to have anything uh, farm-related to the game. Uh, one of the reasons why I like the ability to farm more stuff is simply because... Um, Back when I was younger, I used to grow up playing games like Harvest Moon, and I, I just grew up playing those, and I loved them so much. Um, and Minecraft really reminded me of that, maybe why I like it so much. But of course, it has more creativity to the point where you can just literally build e any and everything. And it's just, I don't know, I, I've always really liked it. But um, I think I've rambled on enough, probably a while now. Uh, I'll go ahead and fast forward through this boring part so you guys can hear me talk as I, you know, build something. So, uh, BRB.
Okay, we're finally done digging and clearing stuff out. I think this is just about enough room uh, to start, anyway. I mean, I can always uh, expand if needed. But, uh, yeah, I think this is good. Also, let's see. Anything creepy out here? Oh, there's a creepy creeper. Oh, my God. Ho, oh, ho, ho. I almost didn't get in in time. Hey, creeper. Hey, creeper. How you doing? Hi. Hi. How are you? What are you doing, huh? Huh, huh, huh? Um, you know what? You stay there. I'm going to go get some sleep, and um, we'll talk about this in the morning. Because I spent all day digging. Mm. Holy crap. How did you... No. 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 I have torches on the ground, everywhere around me. No dark place for you to come in. Come on, seriously. Jeez. Freaking zombies. Zombing up the place. <sighs> I swear, if I get attacked by another zombie... Oh, there we go. Okay. Now to handle you. Yeah, you. Okay, um... Ooh! What the hell? Gotcha. 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 Come on. One more hit. And you're out. Gotcha. Okay, hey sheep. Uh, I don't think I need any wool, but, uh... I go ahead and take it anyway. Uh... Throw all this... Ah, crap, I'm running out of room. I'm gonna need another chest. Or two. Okay, uh... I guess I'll just... Well, I don't want to throw them inside just yet, considering uh, I, I don't want to have to move them. So I'll just throw this here, start filling this with crap I don't need. Wait, why do I have stone right there? No clue. Okay, let's check to see how much our smooth stone is doing. Go ahead and take that, refill it, and... I don't know. Okay, um... Let's see, I need to start building now. Well, that's cool how that kind of came out right there. Probably I'm going to have to fill that in just a bit. Hmm. Okay, let's see. I think I need to get another pick, because this one's just about dead. I need to harvest my reed, because I need bookshelves. And I may have to make a little farm out of that. Okay, let's I'm going to have to fix this waterfall. It looks nice, but it uh, looks a little off at the same time. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's see over here. And I think that's it. The rest I can just gather from the waterfall, I think. Is there any left? Oh, there's some. Okay, we have 30. I'm probably going to need to make a farm out of that. I'm not sure how many bookshelves I'm going to need, but... Uh, I think... Oh, yeah, I think I have, um... Oh, yeah, I've, uh, um, that reminds me. I, uh, did a couple of things. Uh, Better Glass and Better Chest Mod, uh, has been upgraded, so to speak. Um, in short, essentially, it's all now rolled into one, and it's also, it also includes better sandstone, where you can have, like, the texture of the sandstone with that brick thing on top, and still have it in the middle where it, it it's really hard to explain um it, it makes a, a couple of things look better and smoother uh yeah i have it installed right now like the glass the chests i need to fix the chests where they look better but um i made the bookshelves look really kick ass and uh, i'll uh, see if i can make some right now i don't think i have any in here any more read no i don't think i do is it here Okay, let's go ahead and go back then. Poor dog house. Uh, oh, egg. Good, we're going to need eggs for cakes later. I don't think I'll need brown wool anytime soon, but I might as well take it. Hey, sheep, dar, cheap underwear. Um, oh, yeah, of course, I naturally uh, upgraded my texture pack to include all the new textures for better chests and whatever. Um... I made a really cool bookshelf, too. I, I could have sworn I had some reeds somewhere. That's driving me nuts. Oh, well. Let's let's see if I can go ahead and show you. Um, okay, that's how you make paper. I remember now. 
Uh, okay. Should have enough for... Wait a second. Uh, ten bookshelves? Let's see. I need... I haven't made bookshelves in a while. I think I'm going to need more wood. Yeah, I think I will. I know I don't need a workbench to uh, do this, but uh, eh, it doesn't hurt, right? And that should be good. Okay. Half and half. Half and half. Half and half. Okay. Actually, I don't think I need... Wait, is that how you make... I don't remember how to make a book. I could have sworn that was it. What was that? Oh, eggs! More eggs. Okay, good, good. This is kind of pathetic. I, I don't remember how to make a book. Um, great, now I'm going to have to go check. BRB. Oh, I just checked, and I'm an idiot. Um, yeah, I, I kind of had it right, but at the same time, I was kind of off. Uh... Okay, I'm not going to be able to make that many bookshelves, am I? Well, that sucks. Oh well, I'm going to have to farm some reed later. Uh, three bookshelves, that's it. Crap. Okay, I'm going to I'm going to have to get more reed. I'll, I'll make a farm or something. Nothing sophisticated, just a I'll grab this iron pick too for the hell of it. Uh, throw this in. And wait, I need three diamonds to make up. You know what? Never mind. I'll just store those for now. Uh, I, I did want to just show off uh, the better bookshelf mod, which is now integrated as well. Where did I just throw the bookshelves? I know I just had them. Okay, seriously, what, ju what just happened here? Oh, there they are. Whew. Close one. Okay. Um, essentially what this does is, well, let me just show you. Uh, when you place two bookshelves next to each other, they combine into one big bookshelf. And uh, I actually made the textures for this um, kind of myself. It took a long time, and I tried to make it look just right so it didn't look... Uh, it looks like a bunch of different books instead of just one bookshelf texture combined into, into you know, together. Um, it works all the way up to three before you start a new one, and as you can see, it's all different textures on each one. Uh, you may see some of the same books multiple times, uh, but that's just because I, uh, you know, limited amount of book types. Uh, so I just, you know, recolored some, stuck some different places. I tried to make it look really good. Let's see if I can get a torch to get a better view, or better look at this. Uh, the only thing weird with the the better texture, the connection texture mod, or I think that's what it's called, is things look dark when you punch them. And I think that might be a problem with the texture that I used for the breaking thing. Not sure. Going to have to check that out. But anyway, um, as you can see, I think it looks really cool. Uh, all combined like that. Uh, hopefully we can fix it later. And I was going to put bookshelves here anyway, but might trim this one. Not sure. We'll have to see later. Um, let's see. I'm, go I'm definitely going to have a second floor. Let's see. Wait. I need logs. These should do. These should do. Okay. Um, I guess I'll start... Let's see. Bookshelf there. Bookshelf here. I'll just use these as temporary bookshelves, just so I know what they are. Uh, take some logs, and build this little, little pillar thing here. I don't know, through maybe too much. Well, and we can always shorten it. Oh no. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. You know, let me get my axe, just in case. Uh, this is this is kind of the process of building for me. It's uh, actually quite boring, and I'm not sure why anyone would want to watch it. Uh, but uh, they need to fix that too. But anyway, um, 
it's basically me trying out a couple of things and going, wait, does this look right? No, I better redo it. it it's kind of a weird process, but I don't really like to plan anything out. I just like to build it and see how it comes out and keep tweaking it until it comes out just the way I like it. Uh, this should be good. Maybe that. All right. Uh, again, these are going to be bookshelves. Just going to hold it there for now. I'm I'm trying to base this off the house in the on my S and P server, but of course I'm going to make this one much better. Everyone says, "Oh, you have to help building that one," or at least all my friends on the server like to tease me. So I'm going to just basically try to build it myself and inflict my own design. But let's see. Uh, what do I need? I need. Ah, that's what I need. I need stairs. So let's go ahead and make a few of those. Luckily, I remember how to make these. Sad, I know. Okay, that should be exactly a stack. Wow. Okay, okay. Uh, I'm starting to get dark again. Wow, this episode's going on long. Uh, let's see. Stairs. Then have it curve in, like so. fill this in for now. Um, yeah, yeah, this should look good. Come up here, and then the stairs, and then break this away. Yeah, I think this is gonna look just right. Once I uh, finish it, anyway. Hmm. And then maybe put a nice little picture there. I don't know, I kind of want to raise the roof once more. Just so it's more spacious, but I, I, I'll i have to consider that later. Um, I'm going to probably fix this, but for now, it's kind of annoying me. So I'm going to put this here. There, now that looks really nice. Uh, chip this away. Leave that nice and open. And gonna break this away. Oh, it's night time. Uh, okay, luckily nothing's wanting to kill me just yet. Okay, let's go ahead and... Wait, I have some glass. And some smooth stone. Gonna probably change out the smooth stone, but for now, it'll look nice. I can replace it later. Okay, smooth, smooth, smooth. Crap. Uh, get rid of this. Place a little bit of more. And now we have this beautiful glass opening. So like when you come out up through the stairs, you see this glass here. Probably going to have to expand this window a bit. I'm not sure. Let's go ahead and get some, some sleeps and close this freaking door, which I always forget to do. I'm going to have to make that automatic before something kills me. Uh, okay, bed right in the middle of the torches, so nothing can kill me, hopefully. 